even though you have a temporary period of unpleasantness, perhaps fatigue, uh, body aches, um, it goes away in a day or so, and then you've, you've got great immunity. Both Pfizer and Moderna require two vaccine doses taken weeks apart. The second dose gained a reputation in the phase three trial, and now from the experience of millions, that it tends to cause harsher side effects than the first dose. Experts say that's because the second dose is amplifying the lessons of the first dose. Dr. Connick says don't let the possibility of side effects prevent you from getting the second dose. Now, some reports say two-thirds of people report no significant side effects at all. Actually, the older you are, the less likely you are to have those reactions. And I had no reactions. Ready? Mm -hmm. I can tell you that back in September, as a participant in the Tucson portion of the Moderna trial, I did feel side effects, a slight fever and body aches after my second shot of the vaccine. I'm still a volunteer in the Moderna trial. Moderna is checking on how long the antibodies against COVID-19 last. The drug maker also wants to see if a third booster shot may be necessary to protect against the new COVID variants. Dr. Connick credits the revolutionary mRNA technology for the answer to COVID and possibly its variants. With this uh, technology that's really flexible and hopefully we'll be able to adapt quickly to, you know, incorporate uh, booster vac you know, vaccines to address the variants. But with the new variants, especially the one first found in South Africa, Dr. Connick knows the importance of quickly reaching herd immunity. Getting more people vaccinated is the way to get out of this.